Why countries doesn't print more money to make people richer? You'd think it would, right? Just ask Zimbabwe. In the 2000s, the government printed tons of money to solve economic problems, and it got out of control. Prices soared, money became worthless, and people literally needed wheelbarrows of cash to buy bread. Here's why it happened. Imagine a bakery with five loaves of bread and five customers, each with five dollars. Everyone buys one loaf. All good. Now, the government prints more money and gives everyone an extra five dollars. Suddenly, everyone wants two loaves, but the bakery can't magically make more bread. Prices rise to $10 a loaf. This is inflation. The more money you print, the less it's worth, and the more prices climb. Zimbabwe took it to the extreme. By 2008, inflation hit 89.76 trillion percent. Yes, that's 897 followed by 20 zeros. Bills became useless. People couldn't buy basic things. Printing money didn't create wealth. It destroyed the value of money instead. So printing money alone doesn't make a country richer. Real wealth comes from producing goods, creating jobs, and growing the economy. If you love learning how the economy really works, hit like, subscribe, and join the flock here at Economics 101.